Hello, America. Kaylin here. And old Stu. Now, listen up, America. we got to talk right away because there is a doctor who is making headlines on the internet. Um, do I have headlines on the internet? Are they? I mean, look, I'm going to be honest, Kaylin. I don't know if they do, but if they did, she's making them. Uh, yeah. Yeah, she is. Uh, so you might have heard of her, uh, Dr. Stella Emanuel, right? She's been saying all kinds of things and people have been reacting to him, you know. But i got to say, some of the things, not so believable. Some of the things, very believable. And we're going to talk about it right now. So I think we should start with the thing I, I don't believe the most. But it's also, I feel like it's the most minor offense of the things she said, you know. Okay. Apparently, she claims that she's got the cure to COVID-19. And it's in something called hydroxychloroquine. Mm, that's right. I have heard that hydroxychloroquine cures COVID 100% of the time. Yeah. 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 But I don't think that's true. You know what I mean? I mean, everyone knows that hydrochlorine goes in your pool. You know? That's yeah. water. And look, you can't cure COVID by going swimming. Exactly. Exactly. So she's off a nut right there. All right. Right. Um, but she said some other things. So we should probably, you know, talk about those other things as well. So, One of them. so she did say, she did say that uh, they're trying to create a microchip that they're going to place in you to stop you from being religious. Now, now see, we know that's a load of bollocks, right? Because everyone knows the only thing you need to not want to be religious is three hour services. What's that, that about? They, they do go on way too long. You know what I mean? I'll get hungry. It's, yeah. you know, I, I don't have the attention span for that. Yeah, look, look. I know some of you out there are like, no, but we give snacks. Look, you're going to have the body of Christ. You should at least have the garlic herb butter of Christ to go along with it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Make it tasty or speed it up. Look, yeah. you're a demon. You're a sinner. You're good. Five Hail Marys. Everybody bugger off to Olive Garden. You know what I mean? It's oh. that simple. You know what, speaking of demons, that's one of the other things she said, right? Apparently, she claims that when, you know, there's lady problems happening downstairs, that that's a result of people having sex with demons and witches in their dreams. Mm. I'm going to be honest, Caitlin. I have never had sex with a witch in my dreams. I'm... That's true. That's true. Anyone that knows Stu knows he's very protective of his lady bits, you know? But here's the thing. I mean, you know, people are running with this and they're, they're laughing at her and everything. This is very serious, but there's an easy fix. All she's trying to tell you is that if you're going to have sex with a demon or a witch, do it while you're awake. There you go, mate. Look, bang the demon, right? Get the demon sperm, burn it, problem solved. Yeah. That's it. Whatever you got to dilute it with a bit of holy water, whatever you want, you know? Yeah. You know, maybe, maybe you want to give birth to the Antichrist. Keep it for yourself. I don't know. There you go. So, but we've got to talk about the biggest thing that she said, okay? She claims that alien DNA is being used in stuff and also that reptilians are running the government. Mm. I think she might be right. I think so, mate. Look, America, you've got some shady, shady people up there that are making the big decision. So I'll buy it. I'm going to yeah. be honest, Caitlin. I'll buy this. I think this is true. And I think it's up to, to you and me, Stu, to figure out who's who. All right. Who's human? Who's an alien? Who's a lizard person? You know what I mean? Who's yeah. a demon? We've got to figure this out right now. So let, let's okay. start. Um, All right. You know, someone I don't trust, right? The sh shifty eyes. Joe Biden. That's a good one, man. I'm going to go ahead and say he's probably an alien. I, I, I think he's, he gives off those alien vibes. You know what I mean? Like... He's always got to smell people like he's never known what a human smells like, you know? Yeah. Yeah, no, he's, he's always like hugging people, like backwards hugging, hugging for too long, weird touchy stuff going on. It's like he's he's watched telly and he's seen the way that humans are supposed to interact, but he don't quite understand it. You know, right, so he's just trying right. to work it out. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm going alien for that one, definitely. I, I yeah. think you're onto it, bro. Uh, yeah. well, so what about uh, Nancy Pelosi? I'm going to go lizard person for that one, mate. Uh, I definitely think that there's uh, there's a bit of, uh, you know, skin she hasn't shedded in a while. Um, plus, I've never seen a smile. So I've never seen a lizard smile either. That, so that, That's right. They don't. They don't smile because they got bad teeth, you know. So you don't have them smile. But she definitely looks like if she's, yeah, she's the lizard, then she's, well, she spent some time. 
probably too much time outside humping rocks in the sun. You know what I mean? So, yeah. I mean, look, it's better than banging demons, but you know. That's true. That is true. You know, but she should moisturize for sure. Um, what about what about uh, Mitch McConnell? Definitely a lizard obvious. person, mate. That's you don't get the turtleneck without a turtleneck and not be part lizard person. It's just yeah. it's science, you know. I'm sorry, I felt bad for asking because it it was so obvious. I th- I didn't even need to ask. He's definitely a lizard person, you know. Yeah. It is nice to see that these reptilians, though, you know, they they don't segregate the species out. You know what I mean? It's not, you know, we're all part of the government. You a lizard person. You a turtle person. That's fine. Yeah. Maybe they right. should be running things. I don't know. All right. What? Well, what about Jared Kushner? Oh yeah, he's not any of those things, mate. What do you mean he's not any of those things? Have you seen him? Yeah. No, Jared Kushner's a robot. You know what? That checks out. Yeah, Dead no, behind the eyes. This is all Android, mate. This is 100% programming for that guy. Yeah. You know what? I believe it. I believe That's what it is. Trump's daughter got herself one of those Asian sex robots to be her husband. And now he's leading the country in some ways. Yeah. Like, no, no. Speaking of leading the country, Trump, what do you think Trump is? Mate, this is a really tough one because, look, I know for a fact, beyond any shadow of a doubt, that that is something wearing a human skin suit. I, I know it for sure. Yeah. But there's so, I don't know what it could be, though. I don't know what's under the skin suit. Yeah, you know what? You know what you don't know, though? It's because whatever skin that started out to be, he's not taking care of it, mate. You know, everyone knows when you wear leather, you got to treat it, you know what I mean? you got to condition it. you got to keep it from getting wet. And yeah. this, he's just been having a blasty blast with it, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's he, not right. And it's hard because, look, he's got weird alien hands, but then he stands like a lizard. I don't know. I don't know which piece to go with. He's got the belly of a devil, you know what I mean? And he's, right. to be honest, he's got a bit of that, that kind of demon complexion, if you ask me. Right, maybe even a bit of words of the demon, but then he also has got the little... Alien next? I have no idea. I, I, honestly, I'm confused. I, Kaylin, I think we need to figure this out. Yeah, this could be the biggest scandal in the history of the government, right? right. Skingate over here. Yeah. You know? And it's up to you and me to figure it out. You know, we'll give ourselves our, our own code name. We'll, we'll, be, uh, we'll be Demon Throat. Okay. All right. I like it. I like it. Yeah. And we're going to launch this investigation. You know what? And if you... Uh, America, if you've got any tips to help us out and figure this out, you let us know. Till next time, America.